What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and if you're new here, welcome. Tonight we are at the Devil's Tramping Ground again and this time the quality is going to be better from our night vision camera. First, I just want to say super sorry that I haven't uploaded in like a month. I was really sick and also I get married in two months so it's super stressful. But here we are. We're back and instead of giving you guys a super long intro, we're just going to jump right into it. So. Let's go. Oh dear God, don't let me climb through a spider web. <laughs> nod. Not. not. Well, I did not, so that's good. That is a spider web. Landon, look at all those spider webs. <sighs> what is that over there? Shine that, shine the light back, straight back. What? Okay, that was a tree. I thought it was a person, it's Jesus. A so here is the leftover. Yeah. We found a baby goat last year over here and it was like burned and the hoops cut off and here is and a charging thing. What remains of it? Charging port. I see something shiny over there in the woods. You see that? That is a can. Is it? Yes. That's a big ass can. Ooh. I'm good. <laughs> Oh, by the way, I have landed with me. <laughs> How you doing? I will say, out of all the times that I've been here, I've gotten a super, super weird feeling and just felt like something was watching me at all times. I don't have that feeling tonight, but that's not to say that something is not here. And I'm so sorry that the lighting is off. I don't have my other tripod that holds my light. So, I'm holding it. And also there was, I can't see nothing in front of me. I see land in behind me. I see nothing in front of me. Um, every time I've come here, there was always a chair that just sat like in the middle of this open space and it's not here. So we're going to look for it. And I know there's like, I don't know where you're at. So I'm looking in the dark. I know there's always like, um, there's like a shit ton of bones around here. Um, what is that? That's how Ouija board points it. No. Oh no. Is the board here? Uh, oh, it's maybe it. Is that it? Is that the Ouija board? Uh, the board's missing. Yeah, the board's gone. Did you hear that? That was my foot. No, I heard walking over here. Okay, so the planchette's right here. I don't know, but you know what? I think that's all the wood that was laid over here blocking the path. Innocent. Innocent. Okay. okay. There used to be rumors that there was like a satanic church out here and people say all the wood they have piled up here now is from that so I don't know if I have a lot of wood. hello okay owl answered me back did you hear that echo when i said that though yeah so landon has his SLS going. He also has the EMF detector somewhere in oh, his pocket. Yeah. Can you be quiet, please? Thank you. I always wondered what was under those. That looks like a pool liner. It does. I see it. It's like people come out here and dump trash. That wasn't that open last time. I yeah. just... And I don't see the chair. Yeah, the chair's gone. I guess somebody come and got it. Yeah. You guys think I should take the planchette piece home? That is so bright. Oh, it flipped over. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. 
Um, I'm going to insert a clip right here where I looked at it and it was not like that. Okay, so the planchette's right here. And now it's flipped over upright. If there is something out here, can you move that? Looks like you already did. Okay. Scratch. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna happen tonight. Uh, do you guys think I should take it home? Because I think I'm gonna take it home. And, um, what we're not I? taking the planchette home. That was a joke. I don't want that crap in my house. Mm. <laughs> I think we should take it. Don't touch it. I'm watching you. <laughs> Are you? Are you really watching me? I am. So, I was gonna give you guys like a little rundown backstory. Um, if you haven't watched the first video we did here, it's actually the first video we ever uploaded. Um, the legend to this place is that this is where the devil does his dance, pretty much. Um, no. Yes, there is a bear circle. Let me finish. It's there's a there's supposed to be a bear circle here where nothing grows. Um, some UNC college students come out here and tested the soil, tried to plant stuff. The soil was perfectly fine. Nothing would grow, still refused to grow. Everything that's planted here dies. The grass won't grow. Um, and they say that they believe that it is rumored to be either cursed land or... Sure. Sure. <laughs> okay. That's what I think. <laughs> <laughs> or this is where the circle is where the devil is supposed to tramp at night. Like he does his little tramping dance, you know. Um, that's, that's what they say. What do you think? Partly right, yeah, UNC, but it's where he, like, puts his hand behind his back and tramps around just like paces in a circle. And he's plotting his devilishly plots. <laughs> uh, hang on, I'll, I'll act it out for you. I said the same thing. Act it out You're going to act it out? Yeah, this he's is gonna what... Act. In that circle, just like that. That was not a circle. That was not a circle. but I didn't want to walk all the way around. I'm lazy. It looks like asphalt. That is asphalt. They're like, there used to be a road through here. I'm assuming. Or line. it could have been the parking lot to the satanic church. Ooh. Where is he? There's the little guy, y'all. I'm literally about to squish him. Look how little he is. Look, I'm going to put my finger next to him. Oh, he gone. So this has been cleared out recently because this was not here last time and also last time we were here all that over there was so overgrown you couldn't walk through it so they've cut it which makes me curious as to what they're doing out here. Probably building something. That would be my guess. Or it's just hunting trails. Could be. It's coming up deer season. Okay, so we got the bottle, some uh, other trashy items, I think I see a sock in there, there's one of them bags. What do you need a sock for, huh, huh, huh? I can't see nothing in front of me, it's dark. Ah, uh, a little bit of light, that's nice, that's so nice. Ah, this will work, overhead light. What's your first thing? Yeah, I have not been looking for those. Ooh, a jar. Ooh, a jar. <laughs> I got a jar, Dad. <laughs> I got a jar, Dad. <laughs> I guess what's inside it? Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Can I really not take the planchette home? Oh. Oh. You have a Ouija board. Why would you want another one? Because it's from here. I go this way. In fact, has not moved. Hmm. 
Do you hear music? Do you hear music? I guess what we're gonna go ahead and try is the EMF and maybe spirit box. Again, if you hear or see anything that we do not hear or see, because we can't see shit right now, comment down below let us know. Gonna up the brightness a little bit so you can see behind us. I know I look ghostly and sorry. Diane wants me to turn the obvious off, so I'm going to turn the obvious off. I just don't trust the phone app. Because it's a cell phone app. Well, I'm going to pout about it. Okay. You pout. Or you do. We're not hearing anything. We're not getting anything on our EMF. Um, nothing really came through on the spirit box. And, you know, part of me wants to believe the legend because the first time I come out here, I felt like I was being watched. I had the scary feeling and I don't know if it was just my nerves and just the adrenaline that was giving me that feeling or if something really was out here. But right here and right now, I don't have that feeling. I don't, I don't feel like I'm being watched. I'm not nervous. To me, I'm just outside in the woods. So are the legends true? I don't know. Have I caught some EVPs while being out here? I don't know until I go back and review the footage. And I hope I did. I hope there's something on here that wasn't there before. I don't know. I will say the rumors as far as people coming out here and doing rituals and all that, those are 100% true. Landon and I have footage to prove that. Um, I'm going to give a trigger warning here before I go into detail of what we've seen. First time we come in here to scope it out before doing a video, it was probably about this same time and it's... 1.30. It is 12.42 p.m. A.m. Actually, a.m. And, uh... We scope the place out and then I hear Landon telling us we got to go and we got to go now. And I go to look over to see what he's seen and there was a baby goat whose hooves had been cut off, its throat had been slit, and it had been burned and left in a circle with cards and stuff like that around it. And then they had dumped bags of salt, specific types of salt, so that it wouldn't have an odor and it would help it decompose. And those are the bones of the goat that we showed you when we first got here. I will not post that clip because it is very graphic and disturbing to a lot of people. Nothing's proving to me this time that there's something out here. And I, I need that. Because we've been out here for like an hour and the only thing I'm hearing is owls and cows from the farm down the road. I'm gonna walk around a little bit more. Let's walk. Da 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 da. Hole in the butt. Mm. Do I really? Yeah. Where? Don't show the camera. I'm trying to see it for myself. Nobody said I'd put it in the video. I don't see it. It's not there. Oh, <laughs> it was my butt hole. Why? Look, it's not focusing. I think it's bugs flying in front of it. Uh-uh. I don't know. I might have blind those things. It is a pretty cool story if you guys want to do your research on this place to get the legend, what they tell you. This is such a weird angle. Um, I don't know. I just, I'm half and half with this place. Like, I want to believe the stories. I want to believe the legend to it. They say that some people come out here and they camp and do it overnight, and when they wake up in the morning, their tent's been moved out of the circle. Do I fully believe it? Not really. Um, but that's what I'm here for. I'm here to prove, and I guess in a way, prove to myself 
that there is something else out there and have that captured evidence of it. So let's walk around a little bit more and if nothing happens, we may just call it a night, but stay until the end of the video because I do have an announcement for the channel. There was a bug. I want to see if we can look and find the chair. All I'm seeing right now, though, is blue and orange dots. Yeah, it looks like, little, like, it looks like dew droplets. But that is a stick. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that was an actual stick and not like a horn or something, you know. No, tree. <laughs> Bug in my eye. He's right there, guys. Look at the little fella. Hello, Mr. Rabbit. Look, he's so cute. What's a jackrabbit? Jackass. Hey, bud. Look at him. Can I touch the bunny? He's so cute. Probably he's home. There's roofing shingles right there. Yeah, a bunch of bales of straw. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think he's been all balling out here. It might have been, honestly. I still don't see the chair that was out here unless somebody took it. Yeah, I think he got gone. Then again, it could be under all this dirt. Honestly, I hate to break it to you guys, but I don't think this place is haunted. And I have said this before, not all of our videos are going to be super haunted, super spooky. They could be just random exploration videos, um, which those are fun too. Exploring new places and abandoned places is really fun. Um, what was that? <laughs> Did you hear that? It's not gone. I think we may go ahead and wrap it up. If we caught some EVPs, you're gonna see the titles to those in the video. But before you go, here's the announcement I was gonna make at the end of the video. For the season of October, there's gonna be a new series coming. Um, I'm gonna be doing Halloween makeup the whole month of October. Don't expect anything super pretty, super fantastic because I made me under the influence of giggle gash 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 <laughs> that's only for the month of October um, one a week you're gonna get four videos of that happening only for the month of October that's it aside from that I have been working on gathering stories from a lot of our TikTok followers, some Facebook friends, and some subscribers here on YouTube. If you haven't seen the post yet, I am accepting your personal paranormal experiences or your favorite ghost stories, or maybe even stories that you found on Reddit that were super creepy, super cool, super scary. And what I'm starting to do is every single Friday, we're gonna start a series called Friday Spook Nights. And that's where I'm going to sit down with you guys, tell you guys stories, or we're going to hit certain topics for the video, like maybe the discussion of the Lizzie Borden house, the Conjuring house, big things like that. That way you guys can get to personally know me a little bit better, and we can still do all things scary, paranormal, spooky. Um, so that's coming very, very soon. Stay tuned for that. Um... But if you haven't already, check out our TikTok, Instagram, and make sure you like and subscribe. But until then, we're going to head out, and I will see you guys next week. I have the planchette.